two, one, two, woo, one, one, two. Hey, this is Austin Gaming, and welcome back to Dewey's Adventure, and I did end up getting across the bridge, and actually, I found some very useful information. <laughs> okay, he's in sleepy time. Alright, sorry about that. Uh, I actually did end up finding some useful information about uh, settings that I mentioned, like, is there a way to make this not motion controlled? Sadly, there is no directional pad junk. So what there is, there is actually a option for how much, as, well, how much there is as of controlling, tilting. This is actually on the low side. So you really don't have to turn your remote as much. And uh, it's, it automatically sets it up to medium, so in case you guys were curious about that, you just pretty much go to the pause screen options and... Uh, what was it? Options. Um, tilt setting, and then there's medium, high, or low. So, uh, basic information with Sam. Woo. Alright, can I make this jump? I'm pretty sure I can. Uh, leap of faith. Uh, I'm supposed to somehow rock the wind without moving. Really? Is it like up and down? Or is this enough? Oh, that just makes it really high. Okay. Well then. Uh, hopefully that'll go back down. Or I have to jump. Oh. oh okay. Uh, I'm gonna leave you three behind. You guys have your... Your group. You guys can do what you need to do. I mean, without that other guy, I mean, you know, you could talk about how dumb Larry was. Or Jim, or whatever his name. No one really learned his name. Yeah. Oh, there's enemies I'm supposed to kill. Well, what time's better than now? Well, ah, ah, ah. Yeah, okay. So I think I was supposed to destroy those, like, little hat guys, or vials because they're like the other ones were like perfectly done hats and the others that are these on this level they're the that guy yeah because they have like a little bit of a little tilt or not tilt but like a little I don't know how to describe it beacon kind of taste to them and I'm still like not used to the mist thing because, you know, the mist looks so different, so I'm, like, on this setting. Oh. Okay, just gotta do the earthquake and I'll be good. Because, like, I'm used to, like, you know, this is, like, the mist form, and then going down, like, okay, I need to go down to ice, but it's just regular form. So. The tales of, well, <laughs> that happened exactly there. Okay, well, that's fine. Because we can get to that little earthquake enemy spot we needed to take care of. So let's just carefully, oh so carefully, oh. I guess I wasn't good enough on the carefully part, but that's fine. I just gotta get there somehow. With HP. And hopefully in a quick matter. Because there is only so much time for you know, the Let's Plays, and... I am still messed up from this vision thing. Man, I... I have no jumping... Like, I can't... I don't know. I feel like I've always had a hard time with, like... The... Uh... Angles in this game, and, like... Whips actually, like... Jumping... At a good way... Than others. So... Yeah, I made it this time. And, uh, meh. Whew. Alright, I'm back to my swing of things. Oh, no. Okay. wonder if I can actually... Oh. Get over on this one and jump here. Oh, man, that's a lot easier. Should have known about... Uh, oh, 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 I wasn't supposed to do that one. That's the checkpoint. That's actually good to know. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. I thought I wasn't going to make that one. I'm really, really not doing well. 
it's good. Get here and there and up. Oh. Oh. Okay. I always have like this uh, awkward angling issue. Like, oh, I was so close to landing on the on the scales. Not like not the scales. I don't know. I feel like this would be like if you're playing like a hang gliding game. And, I don't know, where is like hang gliding stuff usually done? Like Puerto Rico, or I don't know. And like you're dropping a sack to see like what angle ability. Ah, I'm not, I can't shake harder without moving my guy. Oh no, oh, does that count? Can I, can I get from, okay. Alright, let's try that again. What, what form am I supposed to be in? <laughs> you know what? I don't care. Nope. I guess I care. Nope. No, no, no. Huh. Yeah, this is really unamusing because last time I did the earthquake thing, I was in literally this form. Just shaking it. You know? Just shaking what the mama gave you. Because I think she gave me this Wii U, or the Wii. Yeah, and my grandma, so... Eh, it works. Kind of. Well, maybe. Uh, let's keep trying, because there's only so much that can be... Don't, don't, uh, uh. I really need more HP. I really do. I need to figure out, like, how to do this earthquake properly, because... Ah... Uh, no, no game over is... I, I, I don't know what I could have done. Like, literally, I did the ice shaking on the, the platform, and it was, you know, should have the same result. It, it didn't on that one. Like, what was this? I, I didn't catch, like, what I was, like... What's the prop? I, I don't... It's, it's upsetting. So, let's just keep slipping off the bridge. In real life, that would cause so many deaths. I mean, I guess it's not a high bridge in a general sense. It's like Pecori World, because I mean, like... Well, the Pecori are like little mini, really, really small people in a Zelda Minish Cap. I mean, like, if it's only a bridge this big, I mean, you're not really going to see it. I mean, comparing to a dewdrop, it was like, I don't know, I don't even think like a dewdrop would really have much living ability, oh, okay, let's try that again, hopefully this time not completely fall off, so, eh, eh. yeah, oh, nope, I lost an HP, but that's fine, because I'm assuming he's gonna drop an HP, then I'm going to be going back over there using the earthquake ability on the ice character as I was previously was I like not square enough in the middle of it or I mean I don't think I was not like shaking hard enough like if you shake too hard you're literally gonna fall off the platform and you're you're essentially not gonna do well at all eh. the, Okay, I guess I had to be shaking on it long enough. It's just kind of hard because it's just slippery. There's like nothing that can be done with it or for it or anything, so. I'll probably do like another thing with like the last episode, just like get past that point because you guys don't even need to be seeing this part again. But I'm kind of lazy and I don't want to do that much editing, so. Sorry about that, guys. You're uh, stuck with this, so I'll probably go a little further, just because you know there's a little bit of time left in the in the episode. And it takes a while for me to respond to the key. I have to be like on a certain solid point. I was even like closer, then I stick step back, and I was like, okay, now you have the key. Uh, this game, I like it and I hate it. It's just like one of those types of things. 
Like, you can't help it. It's just, like, you like the little bits and things about this, but overall it's just not good. So, let's just save... Save... Uh, 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 okay, at least I'm gonna be back here. Right? Save the guy that's upset and the guys that are happy. I find it funny they chose, like, to make the rest of them happy and then one sad guy. And what kind of fish is this? It's like... And maybe it's not even a fish. Because it has legs. But it has, like, a fish body. I know that's definitely not a dinosaur. Or, like, a saber-toothed cat. What? Uh, okay. I'm just gonna park right here. Alright. Catch you guys on the next episode, and see you then.